Hey, what's good, my folks? Hey, it's early in the morning. Hey, look, I don't know. Hey, look, but check this out, though. Um, you know, there's been a lot going on, like DMX died and stuff. And the thing about it is, it's like DMX died, he didn't die. It's like Lunell broke the story first and said he passed away. But Lunell, like, had first, like, in the hood. Like, she, she had first in the hood. So, usually, if somebody else, I'm sorry, we're so close, but if somebody else would have broke the story, it'd be more like some of like maybe they just trying to get clouded some other stuff but lunel like it's kind of like almost honestly I almost viewed it in a sense like she just foreseen what was happening and people ran away with it and even the family made a statement and shit to kind of like go but she made the initial statement but it seemed like she just already knew what was popping beforehand you know what i mean when you when you in hollywood but you still in touch with the hood then you see shit happening way faster than most people can even see it happening because that's just how it is when you're in touch with the Hollywood and the hood. Yeah, you see everything happening fast forward. So, you know, I just feel sad, you know what I mean? But you don't feel too sad. I feel happy, you know what I mean? Because he went out how he wanted to high, you know what I mean? That's probably how he wanted to go out. You know, he was happy. Uh, I heard he was at peace. He was relaxing, so he wasn't, like, at war with the at war with the world it seems like you know what i mean he did his last little bid then he came out and everybody was he been he got he been getting show mad love since he got back out and he just been like you know vibing doing his thing and you know what i noticed it's like it's crazy because it's like everybody has like it's it's almost in a sense kind of like what what they be saying like you know what i mean whether you believe in god or not it's like when your purpose is complete you're almost done from here because it seems like most people that die even if we feel like they died too young you know, like, I like how people are finally starting to respect X more than they starting to compare X and DM. They say we lost both legends, both X legends. And it's like, you know, with X, you know, so much more he was going to do that we can't even imagine. But he did what he was supposed to do. He left the mark that he was supposed to. You know what I mean? Even though we know he'd had a... We feel like he'd had a greater mark by being alive, but maybe it was his purpose was filled. You know what I'm saying? We don't always get what we want. We get what we need. You know what I'm saying? We only put what we want inside our bodies and on our bodies and shit like that. The God in the world provides us what we need. And sometimes, you know what I mean? You finesse yourself in better positions. So it's just like, you know, I just feel good. I, just, I mean, I, I don't feel good. I'm sorry. It's good. I just feel like, you know, good in the sense that he got a chance to live. You know what I mean? A full life. He died in his 50s. He died high. You know, they said he was at peace, you know? So, it's sad that, you know, a lot of legends and people that we felt like could really influence the world is dying. And, you know, I'm I'm one of the people I used to be like, well, why can't one of these lame niggas die? And, and I shouldn't feel like that because that's wrong because it's like, you know, maybe while, by the real passing away, it'll make this lame nigga get a little bit real and he better, you know what I'm saying? Because even if you, if, you, if you, even if you don't start out as a super real nigga, it ain't really hard to become real. It's not. Just be real about your shit. You know what I mean? Um, you know, so... And then um, the black man in Virginia, I want to talk about that too because it's just like, that's how they do all the time. And I'm glad that that was on camera and I'm glad they had their body they get body cams because cops a lot of times don't wear their body cams and they don't want body cams. They do not like body cams because they lie. They lie so much in their statements, it's ridiculous. Body cams shuts all that line down. If I'm lying, look at that statement. Look at that statement and see how he just lied about what happened. You know what I mean? Look at how he just lied about how he said he gave him several warnings and all that. Y'all didn't give that man several warnings. Y'all ain't do that. Y'all knew he didn't pull over where y'all told him to see so y'all come out drawing his gun. That's how y'all do. Like, that's how y'all do. And that's how it always is. So it's like, I do something different. If, if y'all start following me, I pull over. If y'all follow me past a block, I know all my paperwork is good, so I'm going to pull over instantly. Okay, where am I? I'll pull over. Get out the car and ask you, do we have a problem, officer? Is there a reason why you're following me, officer? Some people say that to get me shot, but I feel like if I stay in the other way, I'm going to get shot. Because I'm a nigga that's going to get irritated with all this shit you're doing. And you finna just shoot me up, I'll drive off. I'll pull off and yeah, she ain't going to shoot me up for no dumb ass reason. You know what I mean? It's like, no, nah, I can't. That's why it's like, I just thank God. That's why I'm going nowhere like that, too, for real. I'd be like Wendy Williams on my shit, G shit, <laughs> for that. But um, yeah, man. X really was out here spread spread a lot of love and positivity, and he went out in a good fashion. I feel like, and he felt good. I feel like he felt the peace. 
uh, Young X. I always gonna feel like he went too quick. I wish his mama dropped more clothes. I love how they just don't drop them a lot, but I wish they would drop more clothes because I want them shits and I, I don't really like going to buy them off of Holy Grail. You know what I really want though? I want some DMX. If I get some DMX um, overalls, this is hard. You know the ones he wanted at that concert and all that? But y'all know I get down for the cast that be like, I talk too much. Enjoy the moment. Enjoy me talking politics with me. You know what I mean? You don't gotta respond to comments and talk too much. Ask me about something. I don't like how I got that ass gone. But you know what I'm saying? Politic with me. You gonna watch the video anyway. It ain't like I'm showing nothing that it's like no video that's like that. Hey, <laughs> y'all though. Stay good. Hey, and there's just one thing I wanted to say. This is just random. But one thing I wanted to say that was random was the fact that I noticed, I felt like Niggas is already saying rest in peace. Now, I'm not talking about Lunel. Lunel from the hood, so she just got insight. But I felt like other niggas is already saying R.I.P. DMX as soon as he went to the hospital. It's crazy. It's like, I don't know if this nigga's prepared. I don't know what it is, but I ain't like that. Nah. Tighten that shit up. Hey, you know what they me? Just one random conspiracy thought. Um, Just somebody just got informed of. He was buying his masters back. He was planning on buying his masters back. To give each of his kids, you know, 10 million, but it's obviously gonna be more with his masters, but he's planning on buying his masters back and he died. You know, you always gotta bring the conspiracy side, so, you know. Open the door slowly and get out! Get out of the car! Now! Open the door, get out of the car! Hold, 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 hold. hold. Keep your hands outside the window. Keep your hands outside the window. Get out of the car now. Get out of the car. Now. Get out of the car now. Get out of the car now. Yo, what? guess what? I'm a veteran too. I'm going to obey. Get out of the car. Get out of the car now. What's going on? You're fixing to ride the lightning, son. Get out of the car now. Get out of the car now. Get out of the car. Sir, just get out of the car. Work with us and we'll talk to you. Get out the car. You receive an order. Obey it. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly afraid to get out. Can I? Yeah, you, you should be. Get out. What? Get out. Get out the car. Get out now. I have not committed any crime. You're being stopped by a traffic violation. You're not cooperating at this point right now. You're under arrest for, for you're being detained, okay? You're being detained for obstruction of justice. Traffic violation. I do not have to get out the vehicle. You haven't even told me why I'm being stopped. Really? Get, your get, hands out, get out of the car now. Get out of the car. Get your hands off me. Get out of the car. Get your hands off me. You know what? Get your hands off me. Not a problem. Get your hands off me. Back up, there. I didn't do anything. Don't do that. Sir, get out of the car Don't now. Hey, sir. Get out of the car yeah. now. Sir, look, I'm trying to talk get out. To you. Okay. I'm trying to I'm talk. Gonna talk. Get out. Just get relax. out of the car. Can you please get relax? Can get you out. Please relax. Get out of the car right I, now. Now. This is not how you treat a vet. Uh, I'm actively serving this country, and this is how you're going to treat me. Back up, Daniel. I didn't do anything. Back up. Whoa, hold on. Daniel. What's going on? Hold on. I, watch it. Get out of the car. Get out of the car now! Get out of the car now! Sir, just get out of the car! Get out of the car now! Yeah, oh, get out of the car and get on the ground now! You're gonna get it again! I, I don't even want to reach my seat. Okay. Take your seatbelt off and get out of the car! Get out of the car now! Listen! Take off your seatbelt and get out of the car. Look, I'm just going to just please. You're going to do what you're told. Get out of the car. Look, take your seatbelt off and get out of the car. Take your seatbelt off. Look, my hands are out. Take your seatbelt off and get out of the car. My hands are out. Don't reach in there, Daniel. Don't reach in there. My hands are out. Please. Please. Look, this is really messed up. My dog is in the back. My dog is choking right get now. Get out of the car. Take your seatbelt off. What are you, a specialist corporal? What are you? I'm a lieutenant. Lieutenant, get out of the car. Take your seatbelt off and get out of the car. 
You made this way more difficult than it had to be if you just complied. Get out of the car. I'm reaching for my seatbelt. Fine. Take your seatbelt off and get out of the car. Straight onto the ground. Straight onto the ground. Ma'am. Is your commanding officer available? Down. Let's go. Is your commanding Let's officer go. available? Get on the ground. Get on the Can ground. Get on the ground, ground now. On. Get on the ground or you're getting sprayed again. Get on the ground. Can you please talk to me about what's going on? Get on the ground. Get on the ground now. Can you please talk to me Get about what's going on? Get on the ground. Can you please talk to me about what's yes, going sir. on? Yes, sir. You're not. Can you please talk to me about what's going on? Why am I being treated like this? Why? Because you're not cooperating. Get on the ground. Why am I being treated like this? This is really messed up. This is really messed up. <laughs> Sorry, well, just, just work with you. This is fucked up. A time for crying and a time for laughing. A time for mourning and a time for dancing. A time for throwing stones. A time for embracing and a time for avoiding embraces. A time for ooh ooh. A time for embracing and a time for avoiding embraces. What? Come on, come on, come on. Come on. A time for searching and a time for losing. A time for keeping and a time for throwing away. A time for tearing, a time for repairing. A time for keeping silent and a time for speaking. A time for loving and a time for hating. A time for war, a time for peace. I mean, like I said, it goes back to, you know, you gonna start with a prayer, you gonna do this with a prayer? Yo. There are no words more powerful than the book. And your prayer, your own prayer, will do a lot better than someone else praying for you.